This video is sponsored by Namira Technologies, your power sports piston and gasket supplier since 2001. They have a huge selection of motocross, ATV, two- and four-stroke applications at prices that'll make you smile all the way to the checkered flag. Go to Namura.com. that's N-A-M-U-R-A.com to see what's up. Hi, I'm Scott Atkins with Pro SX MX Tech, and today I'm going to show you how to change the oil in this 2018 Honda CRF. 250. First thing you want to do is go ahead and remove the skid plate. To speed things up, I'm going to use an uh, impact. Again, when using an impact, only use the impact to remove bolts, not reinstall. With our skid plate removed, now you can take a six millimeter Allen and underneath there's the drain bolt. We'll go ahead and remove that. And drop the oil. While that's draining, I also like to go ahead and remove the oil filter. And then be careful of the spring behind the filter. Okay, with the oil now properly drained, we'll go ahead and clean out where the oil filter sets. And then we can go ahead and inspect our crush washer. Um, you just want to make sure that these aren't too uh, used over and over too many times. Um, what will happen, it will start to leak. So I like to replace the crush washer every three or four oil changes. Now with the oil out, we can go ahead and reinstall the drain plug. Next, when reinstalling the oil filter, make sure that the spring goes in the back and then if you read on your filter itself, it says outside or towards cover. So make sure you get this correct. And then when reinstalling the filter, the spring will sit on the post in the back. And then simply reinstall the cover. I like to hold in on the cover as I tighten the bolts um, so you don't rip the o-ring that is actually on the cover itself. Next we'll go ahead and measure out the proper amount of oil. In this case it's 1250 cc's. Now that we have our new oil, uh, 1250 cc, we can go ahead and add it back to the bike right here. I like to use a funnel for this case. It can get a little messy. Now that we've added our 1250 cc, go ahead and reinstall the oil cap. And then next we can go ahead and reinstall our skid plate. Um, the longer bolt goes in the back, 
And on the new Hondas, just be very careful. The bolt back here is actually angled. So if you're not very careful, you can get it cross threaded. So I like to start my, all the bolts by hand. And then go back in with my T-handle. and then double check. And that's how you properly change the oil and service the oil filter on this 2018 Honda CRF 250.